Welcome back. We showed you this spectacular view of the moon at the top of the hour. It's called the harvest moon and for good reason. It's harvest season and you have a chance to check out the harvest happening in Amador County wine country this weekend. It's the annual Big Crush Harvest Festival. It's a lot of fun to go check it out. Paul Sobon from Sobon Estates is joining us this morning to tell us more about the event and of course, you brought someone to stomp grapes for us. I brought a grape stomper and brought <laughs> grapes, exactly. What are you say? This, and this is, I mean, for a lot of people, this is the stuff that they want to see. Yeah, they do. It's love it. It's, it's getting in there, getting your feet, getting your hands in it. We're going to have some grape stomping up at Sobon Estate uh -huh. over the weekend. It won't be in a barrel. It'll be a little bit larger vessel. And then we're going to have some punch downs of the red fermentation going right. on at Shenandoah Vineyards and lots of great wines to taste and some good food to snack on. As a winemaker, does it, do you watch, you know, kind of the way it used to be done and think, thank goodness I don't live back then. Well, you know, it's kind of funny. <laughs> a friend of mine is doing a small batch of rosé and you have to get a little skin contact. So even this year, even modern times, sometimes you'll use foot, foot treading. On really? Things. Yeah, it still happens. That's really interesting. Uh, I would have thought everything would be automated yeah, at this it's, point. It's almost all, but every once yeah. in a while you'll get something fun like that. And it's, it's really interesting. It's still a very traditional Portuguese way to do with, for port varieties. They'll do this. And what was, it, what was it about the foot stomping? That, oh, I think it was just, just so you could basically keep extracting more and more mm -hmm. color and keep macerating these things, the skins, because all the color in, in wine is in the skins. Right. So, yeah. What are you noticing out of the harvest this year? Given given the weather that we had in the last year, it's interesting to talk to different growers. Well, you have such an amazing normal winter, even above normal rainfall. So you had great growth in the spring, and then harvest kind of came on with a... Hang on a second. Patrick, you're slowing down. What's up, man? Come on. <laughs> <laughs> I stopped hearing anything happening over there. You know, with that heat in the beginning of, uh, of uh, September, harvest was crazy, and then it got so cold and sort of dewy and wet and slowed down, but the last two weeks we've been going at it really hard. Do you so. notice that, that the texture of the grapes, the taste of the grapes being different because of those things? Or is no, it? You no, you know, it's just such a great year. We have good crops finally, mm -hmm. nice production, beautiful wine so far, really great grapes. We started picking this morning. We do mostly night picking, so we started picking this morning at 12.30. Do you do night picking because? Well, I always use the analogy, if you go to your garden at four o'clock in the afternoon, you taste a tomato, and then you go out there at six in the morning and taste a tomato, it always, that cold old crisp fruit I always taste better. It relates to wine. Same That's really thing. interesting. And then with the harvest moon, you have, you know, nature's light bulb there for yeah, you. Exactly. That's, That's just a real bonus to on the ride down here today. It was incredible. Very good. Well, yeah. Patrick's got a lot of work to do if he wants to have a glass of wine here. <laughs> 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 got to earn your keep there. Yeah. The festival's going on Saturday and Sunday. It goes from 11 a.m. to 4 p.m. Pre-sale ticket sales have actually ended, but you can still go up and get a ticket the day of. Just head to amandorawine.com for more information. I'm thinking of the the, uh, the old Lucy clip oh, yeah. right now. Still one of oh, the yeah. funniest things oh, that I yeah. have ever seen on yeah. TV. All right, well, nice you can job. Come up and, you can come up and jump on grapes yourself. Come oh, to, yeah, come you to know Sobon me well. this week. <laughs> Sounds good. I'd probably, probably just like pop open a glass with you. Or that, you exactly. Pop open a bottle. Thanks so much and good luck this week. You're it welcome. should be Thank absolutely you. gorgeous.